Hello and welcome aboard Executive Airways. This is your captain speaking and on behalf of myself and all of the cabin crew who will be looking after you today, we would like to wish you a safe and pleasant flight. Now on board today, I would like to personally advise you to join the Mile High Club Dining Circle. Yes, our brand new dining service, where the service is as high as the sky. We have a wonderful brand new menu created by a Michelin star chef. From delightful breakfasts to indulgent dinners, with a fabulous drinks menu as well. Your first is of course complimentary, and do make sure you have some cock tails in the sky for that relaxed buzz you need. Should you need anything whilst on board, our cabin crew are there to serve you. I wish you a safe and pleasant flight and we have a current flight time of around 6 hours and 50 minutes. Thank you. Well, hello Dad. Welcome aboard Executive Airways. Thank you for just taking a moment there to listen to our captain today. I will be your personal server and my name is Lucy and it will be my job to ensure that you have the most comfortable and relaxing flight possible. So you have joined us for a morning flight that means we will be serving breakfast shortly. So we do have a brand new menu. We do. Would you like me to go through it with you or have you flown with us recently before? Mm. Absolutely. Before we have a look through the menu, can I get you some more water at all? You're okay for the moment. Good. You just let me know though if you need anything at any time. Okay. Let me just get our new menu. Here we go. So. As the captain mentioned, we have had a cheeky little redesign of our dining service. So this breakfast service is part of the Mile High Club Dining. And as you can see, we have a brand new menu. It's lots and lots of rather lovely offerings. We do actually normally test a lot of the food ourselves and I have to say that there are some really, really delightful treats. So, do you have anything in mind at all that you fancy? I think sometimes reading through a menu, you can sort of spark your appetite. Absolutely. So let's start with the hop offerings. Okay, first up we have a classic, the full English breakfast. So in this you have your eggs cooked just how you like them, smoked or unsmoked bacon, and you can request whether you'd like it crispy or just nice and soft. Then you then have a beautiful, beautiful sausage, and the flavour of this is just delightful. You then have a rich, juicy tomato 
beans, hash brown, and then toast and butter. And we do have a selection of breads available on board. So if you have a particular penchant for a certain type of bread, just let me know. Oh, also, do you have any allergens or dietary requirements we should know about? Mm hmm Okay, no, that shouldn't be a problem. Okay. So, next up we have the vegetarian, full English. So again, eggs cooked to your choosing. May I say that Chef does wonderful, creamy scrambled eggs. Really delightful. Of course, you could have your poached egg, or perhaps a boiled egg or two, or maybe a nice fried egg. Whatever you desire. You then get two vegetarian sausages. Now these have a really wonderful herby flavour. Really, really lovely. You then have mushrooms, tomato, your baked beans, and hash brown, and again, your toast and your butter. And you can request, as well, what type of butter you would like. So, should you prefer salted or unsalted? You just let me know. Moving on brings me to those delightful scrambled eggs. I really must stop saying delightful, but I have to say these offerings really are tasty. Now we have scrambled eggs on sourdough toast. Now, if you don't like sourdough, we can, as I mentioned, do this on any type of toast. Chef just thinks that slight piquancy from the sourdough just mixes really well with the scrambled egg. And that's done with two eggs softly scrambled. If you would prefer a firm egg, just let me know. And also we do have smoked salmon, which is optional. Moving on, we have our classic eggs benedict. So this is poached eggs, ham off the bone, on a toasted English muffin. Then, we have our vegan chocolate and banana pancakes. And these are fluffy, American style pancakes with chocolate chips and banana. And I have to say, I'm not a vegan myself, but if anything could make me convert, it would be those. Then, of course, you can have a bacon or a sausage roll. So, again, smoked or unsmoked bacon, a regular sausage or a vegetarian sausage, in a soft ciabatta style roll. So it's a little bit crispy, nice and soft in the middle. And of course you're choosing of the sauce. And then you can have toast or a warm roll selection. So they are all your hot offerings. Anything taking your fancy so far? Mmm. That's the trouble, isn't it? You almost don't want to fill yourself up too much because of all the nice snacks on board. I do understand. Okay, let's move on then to the cold selection. Okay, this may be a little bit more to your fancy. So, we have croissants with jam or marmalade, and you can have as many as you like. You can then have muesli with your milk of choice. So we do have a range of nut milks on board. Okay, um, soy milk, every milk you can think of. Okay, 
Um, you can then have a yogurt selection with some fresh fruit. We've got some muffins, including vegan ones and gluten-free ones. And then you can have a selection of meats and cheeses. Anything at all taking your fancy there. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Well, seeing as you are so nicely, I definitely think we could put together a little mix of a cold selection for you. Mm -hmm. So, potentially the croissants, jam or marmalade? Marmalade, okay. Yes, we have some lovely, lovely tangy, crispy apples. Mmm, they're really, really lovely and fresh. What flavours do we have available? Hmm, um, I believe in the yoghurts we have strawberry, uh, blueberry. We have a lovely, lovely new cherry one. That's really nice. Um, I think that may be it today. Yes, um, any of those take your fancy? Of course. They have been quite popular, actually. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we have some left. I'm sure we do. And what about uh, maybe um, some cheese? Mm -hmm. Yes, we have mature cheddar. Yeah, would you prefer a soft cheese? A hard cheese is fine. Perfect. Okay, well... I will see what I can do then. I will. Would you like me to read through the drink selection? Absolutely. So we have our wonderful range of fresh juices on board. Now, the classic, obviously, is some lovely freshly squeezed orange juice. Mm-hmm. That's really we do also have apple juice, pineapple juice, cranberry juice, and oh, did I forget one? Ah, grapefruit juice. Okay. We then also have a range of smoothies, and these are wonderfully creamy and very filling as well, actually. So, we've got banana berry. We've got strawberry vanilla, then we have mango and strawberry, and I have to say that one is a particular favourite of mine. Then we have chocolate and vanilla. Mm -hmm. A little bit of indulgence. Never hurt anyone. <laughs> then of course we have our range of coffees and teas. Mm -hmm. Are you more of a coffee person or a tea? You like both? Very good. Well, you can get a double espresso, cafe americano, cappuccino, a lovely latte, or we have our range of teas. So we've got a lovely, refreshing and reviving English breakfast tea. We then have a cooling peppermint tea and a nice relaxing chamomile tea. Mm hmm Absolutely. Yes, that's not a problem at all. If you fancy a hot drink a bit later on, won't be an issue. Okay, so um, let's just double check. I'm doing you a nice cold selection mix. Okay, not a problem. And you'd like to go with the orange juice. Mm hmm Do we have one that's bottled? Um, normally we do just provide our own freshly squeezed. Um, I will have to check. Okay, um, but I'm sure that won't be a problem. Okay. Um, can I get you any water still or sparkling? Mm hmm 
absolutely. Um, I think we have a nice refreshing lemonade. Yeah? Oh, it may not be lemonade, it may be lemon juice. As I say, we've recently had a little restock of all our bar and our food, so... I'll have a look for you. Okay. Alright, you just sit there. Okay? And I'll be back in just a moment. Before I bring you your food, I actually wanted to bring you this before I pour it to see if it's something you'd like. This is an all-natural sparkling lemon beverage with 12% lemon juice. And it's got no artificial flavours or in Jersey, in the Channel Islands, and I have to say, I have had this one, it slipped my mind, but it is particularly nice. Mm. It's not as mm, sharp as some lemonades can be, and because it's nice and sparkly, just gives that lovely, refreshing taste. So what do you think? Yes? Excellent choice. And would you like ice with your drink? Mm-hmm. And what about an extra wedge of lemon? Perfect. I'll be right back. Okay. So, would you like me to open this and pour this for you? Wonderful. Just take off the seal. Now, cans, as we know on board, can be a little troublesome, but Give it a little tap. Okay. Let's see if it will behave. There we go. Just let it settle a little bit. Ah. Perfect. So I've got your glass here with your wedge of lemon and your ice. Let's pour some of this in. I'll just pour it up to there for you. Okay. And we'll place the other on your tray. Okay, we'll just pop those down there. And would you like a straw at all? You're okay. Okay. Okay, so let's just... Is that alright? Perfect. And would you like a straw? You're okay. okay. We have actually got our brand new paper, recyclable and biodegradable straws on board if you do change your mind. Okay. Now, I have prepared your cold selection. Mm -hmm. So, let me just get that for you. Okay, so I've got a little mini feast for you. I have. So, what I wanted to do was create a little mezze for you. 
So here we have our croissants. Don't worry, this has been prepared even though of course my hands are clean. This has been prepared using gloves. Okay, so you have your two croissants, freshly baked this morning. And if I may say, they are lovely and buttery and rich, but also nice and fluffy. Then, you said you would like some marmalade, so, so we have a nice, fresh little pot of orange marmalade there for you. Now, you wanted some cheese, mm -hmm. so I bought you these nice little packs of cheddar cheese, so if you'd like to cut those and put them on your croissants, then you can do so. I also bought for you the nice black cherry yoghurt. Now this is thick and creamy and honestly, I just think it tastes amazing. Now I also bought you a jar of Marmite. Okay, if you'd like to have that with your croissant. And then I bought you a nice fresh apple. And also a couple of packs of lovely lotus biscuits. So you've got your spoon for your yoghurt just there, and you'll notice in front of you, you already have your knife and fork, should you need it, and of course a serviette as well. Okay, are you happy with this selection? I can go back and change some things or add some more on. Are you sure? Oh, you're very welcome. Okay, let me place this down for you. There we go everything there. I think you're okay for room. Perfect. Would you like a little side plate at all? You're okay. Wonderful. Well, I'm going to let you enjoy that. I'm sure you will. If there's anything that's not to your fancy, you'd like to change anything, you just let me know. It's not a problem. I'll leave you with your drink and your food then, and some of our in-flight entertainment, which I think you'll really find nice and relaxing. I'll be back in just a few moments. Okay. Welcome to Executive Airways in-flight relaxing entertainment. We hope you enjoy your viewing today and have a wonderful, relaxed flight. You're going to feel so refreshed, so happy in the morning, because you alone have been able to achieve that perfect night's sleep. And that's what this is all about, just achieving that perfect night's sleep. I don't want you to have to worry about anything, stress about anything, because now it's just your your time to just be calm and rest and feel happy because I'm with you now helping you to just fall asleep helping you to stay Calm, helping you to achieve that rested state, 
soon as the sound of the rain just continues to relax you, you can just drift deeper and deeper, knowing that you are repairing your mind and your body. This is your time. You don't need to do any tasks. I'm just here with you to help you relax. Sometimes when we don't allow our minds to switch off, we can find ourselves like you were doing, just up and about or tossing and turning, maybe flicking through our phones. That's not what we need. We just need to hear the sounds if you would like. Maybe add in sound of a campfire. You can just hear the sound of a crackling fire and sound of the nightlife in the background and you can just picture yourself for a moment just laying under the stars with the warmth from a roaring fire that slowly crackles under the starry sky And you feel your eyes just getting heavier as you enjoy the sound of the crackling fire and the peaceful night. This is your time, your special time, your time to unwind. Feels nice, doesn't it? Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed our in flight entertainment program. For your full choice of programs, please feel free to scroll through the menu. Thank you. Well, how did you enjoy your food? Oh, I'm so pleased. I can see actually you've still got. Mm -hmm. Just having a nice little graze. Wonderful. And how did you enjoy the entertainment? Oh, I'm so pleased. It's really important to us to get our customer feedback. We'd like to always be improving our in-flight experience, so thank you very much. Now, um, I presume you would like to be left with the remainder of the food. Not a problem, and you're still okay by the looks of it for your drink. Okay, can I get you anything else at all? Mm-hmm. Oh yes, our captain did mention our new cocktail menu. Mm-hmm. Let me get it for you. This is the Lucy in the Sky with Cocktails brand new menu. And I have to say, I love, love, love all of these. I know that's quite bad, isn't it? <laughs> but I really do 
too. I think it's such a lovely selection and I love all of the names of the cocktails as well. We do also have um, a selection of other beverages as well that aren't cocktails. Did you want to see those first or afterwards? Afterwards. So, first off we start with the Mile High Special and this is with Tanqueray Gin, Cranberry Juice, Lime Juice, sugar syrup and soda water served on the rocks we then have the high flyer and this is served with a simple syrup tamarind nectar and a ginger ale served in a highball glass we then have destination calm and you may like this this includes orange juice, grenadine, and is served on the ice and garnished with an orange wedge. We then have the flirty flyer, and this is with apple liqueur or juices shaken with ice and served in a martini glass. Now this one is particularly lovely. Off the job, of course, I have enjoyed Then we have Flying Free, another personal favourite. This is rhubarb and apple gin, vodka, tonic water, sugar syrup, cinnamon, served on the rocks with a lemon wedge. Then we have the Calm Flyer. This is vodka, Mediterranean tonic, and lemon juice, served on ice in a low ball glass with a twist of lime. Then, just like you, we have the perfect passenger. This includes cranberry juice, triple sec, and lime juice shaken with ice and served martini style. We then have Cabin Fever with grapefruit juice, cranberry juice and gin served on the rocks. This is lovely and tart and refreshing. Then we have the in-flight entertainer. This has got club soda, half and half and coffee liqueur served on the rocks. And last, but by no means least, we have the Frequent Flyer. This is with gin, grenadine, bitters, passion fruit, orange, lemon and lime juice served on the rocks. So there we have our lovely Lucy in the Sky with Cocktails brand new cocktail menu. Have any taken your fancy? Mm. Yes. What's your personal favourite drink, if you don't mind me asking? Ah, classic. Yes. Yes, absolutely we can do that. Any particular type of gin? Mm -hmm. um, we have Bombay, uh, Tanqueray, Gordon's, yes, number 10. Of course, would you like a single or double? Very wise. And tonic water, mm -hmm. any particular type? We do have Mediterranean tonic on board, some flavoured tonics, or just classic. Yes, I do think we have a light. Perfect. Would you like to see some of the other drinks just before you make your final decision? Mm-hmm. 
Okay. So, here by the way, I did manage to find you a bottled orange juice, okay, if you would like that. And the rest of the drinks we have here are some of our canned range of alcoholic beverages. So we have rhubarb gin and ginger ale, okay. We have our Coke Zero. We then have, oh, there we are, our light tonic water, so I can use this in your gin and tonic. We then have nice fruity rosé. And then we have, I believe this is a, yes, a pink gin and tonic. So we have all of those. Do you any take your fancy? Mm-hmm. Yes, absolutely. Let me just place this down a moment. So there we are. Would you like me to get you a fresh glass and pour this for you? You just like it in the bottle. Okay, there we are. So, just one gin and tonic then. Perfect. And any particular glass preference? That won't be a problem. I'll be right back. Okay, so I have your gin in here, and as requested, I have lined it with some fresh slices of lemon. And lots of people tend to drink lime with gin and whilst I think that's a fine addition I must say the tanginess and refreshingness you get from lemons paired with the gin is just really uplifting and refreshing without being too sour so I was just a moment longer because I had to go and find a bottle opener. One of the other girls was using it. Okay, so I have here your tonic. Okay, would you like me to pour it for you? Absolutely. imagine you don't want a straw as you didn't want one before. Okay, all right then. Well, I really, really hope you enjoy your gin and tonic. There we go. Now, is there anything else at all that I can get you? Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. Well, let me go and check the snack trolley. I'll be right back. You said you'd quite like something a little bit salty, but also a little bit sweet. Okay, so I've got a few things that I think you'll like. Mm -hmm. So first up we have some salted peanuts. These are particularly nice ones. And in this convenient little sized pack, so if you don't finish them all on today's flight, you can pop them in your pocket and carry So, we have those. 
then if you would prefer we do have some dry roasted peanuts so equally as delicious and you did mention that peanuts were your favourite nut so we have these Um, yes, these ones are 91% peanuts, the others are 95 Okay. You're welcome to have a little look through the ingredients if you wanted to check anything. Okay. Alright. Now, to tempt your sweet tooth, I have these. Now, these are actually a travel exclusive and these are Cadbury's Dairy Milk Minis and yes, you do get the whole pack mm -hmm. so plenty to keep you going although I have to say that I would get through these And because these are in a slightly smaller size and shape, I particularly love these for dunking. Mm hmm You've not dunked chocolate in tea. <laughs> it is very, very naughty, but rather lovely at the same time. Oh, and we did say, potentially, would like a hot drink as well. Mm hmm Yes, I do actually have um, the tea selection on my tray, so let me just show you that before I leave you to your drink. So, we have here not only our English breakfast tea, we also have some Earl Grey and also some Darjeeling. So they are nicely leaf teas and we leave them to infuse in our nice little tea pots. So the Earl Grey is a timeless expression of robust Assam and Italian bergamot. The English breakfast is organic black tea and this complex malted undertones for a satisfying start to your day. And then we have a sought after single origin tea from the Monteviot estate. So a bit later on, should you like a nice cup of tea, I thought I would show you these ones in particular. So, has any of the snacks taken your fancy? Mm-hmm. Yes. Any salted ones? Of course. And anything else? Oh, excellent choice. The dairy milk minis. There you are. I really, really do hope you enjoy all of your selection today. Oh, it's my absolute pleasure. Are you comfortable with the, the aircon at the moment? Lovely, and you've got enough support for your head and neck? Wonderful. The earphones, they are okay. Good, and they are complimentary. They are our nice in-ear ones, so they're particularly good for when you want to go to sleep. Okay then, I will leave you to enjoy the rest of your flight for a moment, and I will be walking around the cabin. Should you need me at all, you can just press the little button above your head. Okay? Wonderful. Well, it's my pleasure serving you today, and I look forward to continuing to serve you throughout the flight. 
You're very welcome. I'll see you soon.